Hey guys, my name is Mr. B and today I'm gonna give you guys a full tour on the new bedroom gaming room. All right guys, let's not waste any time and let's get straight into the tour. So as you walk in, you can kind of see where all of the magic happens. This is where I have been streaming for a pretty long amount of time. We had to kind of put a custom L-shaped table in here so that we could fit both of the monitors, we could fit the keyboards, we could fit whatever extra stuff we needed on this table. So I know that a lot of you guys want to see the PC straight away. So this is the PC that we added to this room. It's a master PC. So this PC comes with a 3090 graphics card and an i9 processor and we tried to put as many RGBs as possible. There are so many fans in the PC trying to cool it down that when I play different games like Fortnite you can just hear it, hear it constantly just because the fans are working so hard to cool the PC. And also for all of the people who are wondering about the cable setup here, it's uh, pretty clean, not gonna lie. We've got all of them mostly behind the PC because it's so massive. The internet cables are actually pretty flat so they can go under the baseboards. I'm gonna leave all of the details for the PC in the description box down below. So now that we covered the bottom of the table, I wanna cover the top. So for the second monitor I use, I use a Pixio monitor which is a little bit bigger than the Alienware monitor and this is what I use to read chat and also play some PS5. Mostly the two games that I've been playing are uh, NBA 2K21 and Spider-Man Miles Morales. I'd say that Spider-Man would be my favorite game on the PS5 so far. These are all of the controllers that I use uh, with my PC and the PS5. We've got two PS5 controllers and I've also got a custom Space Station scuff controller which I use for like Fall Guys. Now, let's get into the keyboard and mouse. For my keyboard, I use a SteelSeries Apex Pro, and I've kind of customized the keycaps a little bit. So I use rubber keycaps, and I had a couple more purple keycaps from some Ducky keyboards that I just wanted to put on because they look really awesome. One of the coolest things about this keyboard is that I added a fidget spinner keycap to this keyboard so that when I get bored, or I'm waiting for a game to load, I just uh, mess around with the fidget spinner keycap. If you remember from the last gaming room tour, I just brought my keyboard into this room. This mouse I have been using for a while. It is the Final Mouse Cape Town. I love this mouse so much. It's very small, very nice, very light, and uh, I'm just probably gonna keep using it. This is a pretty new thing that we added to the streaming room, but it is the Stream Deck, and this is an extra large Stream Deck. So what this Stream Deck does is it actually controls a lot of the stream stuff, so scenes, sounds, basically anything that I would need to pull up on my stream. For my mouse pad, I just use an extra large HyperX mouse pad, and I just think it's great. We also have some Nanolite LEDs up on the wall, just because it's great as a light source when I'm trying to record or stream gameplay. We have a little Logitech webcam camera right here, and this is used for card openings and sometimes keyboard cams. But the main, the main, main camera that we use is the Canon 80D. This camera is massive, and this is what I use for face cams or green screens for gameplay and streaming. If we do need a green screen, all you have to do is reach from right under the bed. And ladies and gentlemen, full green screen pops out. You pull it, and boom! You've got a green screen for gameplay, or just streaming, or just if you wanna have like a nice little background when you're playing with your friends. If anyone was wondering, this is what it looks like with the green screen. So on the left side, I've got a little drawing pad because I do like to draw a little bit. And I've got my Oculus Rift S controllers. I've also got a Fortnite statue that was sent to us by Epic Games back in like Fortnite season one. And I've got my prize possession card, my Charizard VMAX Rainbow Rare that I pulled. If you guys didn't watch that video already, I suggest that you check it out. But uh, this is my prized Pokemon card right here. We've also got a genuine meteorite sent by my team Space Station. We've also got a little Naruto figure and we've got some Marvel comics. And these are my gaming glasses and these are what I use to remove all of the blue light from any of my screens. And these really help my eyes so that they don't get damaged from uh, playing too many video games. This bedroom is completely different from our other gaming room which 
is still here, but now we use this room for uh, when my dad has to edit or when my friends come over or just family gaming. All right, guys, that wraps up the full bedroom gaming room tour. If you did enjoy it, make sure to like and subscribe. I'm going to leave the PC specs in the description down below, but I want to show you guys the last, the final, and the best part about this room. Oh, when I'm tired, I just go to sleep. Thanks for watching. Peace.